Hey guys, and welcome back. My name is Ramtin Dakota, and my goal is to show you how to write a custom herbal formula in under five minutes using our My Herbal Pharmacy site. For patients and practitioners, today I'll be discussing insomnia. If this is something that interests you, please subscribe and like, as it goes a long way in supporting our videos, and it makes sure that you don't miss out. So speaking of uh, insomnia, this is one of the most commonly treated conditions in our clinic. Um, most of the time there is an underlying uh, second, it's usually a secondary symptom. Uh, there's underlying issues such as depression, anxiety, stress, um, unresolved febrile diseases. Now this you're gonna see a lot with your COVID long haulers, we'll discuss in another video. But as always, TCM, it is in, in TCM, it is so important to focus more on the pattern and not the name of the conditions. So today we'll be discussing insomnia due to blood deficiency. Now, the etiology for this condition is described as deficiency overwork. Now, the liver stores blood and houses the spirit at night. Now, we say in Chinese medicine, the spirit sleeps in the liver blood and at night um, and in the morning, it comes out through the eyes. When there's insufficient liver blood, the hun, the spirit, does not have a bed to sleep in and it comes out to play. When the liver is deficient, it also leads to blood stasis. This stasis then leads to heat and that heat harasses the heart. So that's where we get the heart palpitations, the night sweats and the dry mouth. Please keep in mind that this is deficient heat. So here are the things to look for clinically. Patient has a pale complexion, bruises easily, women with light periods. By the way, I see this mostly, this pattern mostly in women. Um, a pale tongue, a thin pulse, night sweats, memory issues, heart palpitations and anxiety. I also see this frequently in vegan and vegetarians who are not paying too good of attention to their diets. As always, we'll start with a base formula and begin to modify. All right, let's write the prescription. We're gonna start off by creating a prescription by clicking this tab here. Okay, and from this screen, you could pick an existing patient or create a new patient. I'm just gonna go ahead and pick an existing patient and start a new formula. All right, this is our dashboard. Let's go ahead and start. So as you know from our previous videos, there's multiple ways of adding a formula. Um, sometimes we request help from the software. Sometimes we already know the um, formula and ingredients. And we always start by clicking Add Formula. From this point, I'm just curious to see what the formula finder shows. So we're going to click Insomnia here. And the software will provide the correlating patterns. Well, these are some of the common ones. I always use this tab just as a starting point. Um, let's see what it shows. Okay, do we have blood deficiency? All right, let's see what we've got. I click blood deficiency and the uh, software will generate common formulas. And sure enough, it is Swan Sao Rentong, the formula that I did want to discuss, but we will definitely modify this. So let's click Swan Sao Rentong and add the formula. Voila, just a few clicks. You have all the ingredients and the dosages. Dosages look good to me. Um, I do like to have a big dose for Swan Sao Ren, in which case our software is recommending a pretty large dose here. So um, great formula. I love this formula, as you know. Um, it's prescribed very frequently, but usually for the wrong patterns. This is truly for a blood deficiency pattern. Um, let's go ahead and modify this. Let's make this better. I always like to add additional herbs to reinforce that. So let's go ahead and add formula. We're going to add a whole nother formula to this. And of course, our blood formula, right? Sibu Tonk. And I like to always watch and see on our dashboard, on our uh, um, screen here, to see which formulas overlap. So which ingredients overlap? So as we're looking at this, as we can see, Chuan Xiang, Fu Ling. Okay, we have Chuan Xiang in here. I'm just gonna delete that. 
we don't have Bai Xiao in this formula. What a great herb to add to this formula. So we're going to leave that. And we don't have Donggui, another great herb to add to this. And Shudi Huang. Wonderful. I'll add all three. We're going to borrow these three herbs from Si Wutong and add it to Suan Zhao Rentong. Most commonly with these patients, I do see night sweats. I always like to add the following. I like to add... Okay, we're going to add Bai Wei. And for deficient heat with some sweating, sometimes I also like to add D Goopy. Okay, I'm going to put about 8 grams each. Beautiful. Formula is done. Now, this is a raw formula. These are the ingredients per packet. Now, if you want to do a, a granular formula, click one button, swap over to granular. How many grams a day would you like this? We recommend that in granular formulas, about three to four scoops twice a day. So at three scoops twice a day, um, each scooper is 1.5 grams. So it's about nine grams a day is what it translates to. So most granular formulas, we do nine grams a day. So how many days would you like that for? For this patient, I'm going to do about 10 days. So that's 90 grams. I just type it right in. If you want to do more, you can always add more. If you want to it's a very specific number of grams you can add it in here it will do the math for you so i could add 130 135 grams i like that number because that's the what fits in one of our big bottles it's about two weeks supply so i'm going to go ahead and click convert software did the math for you here we are every single ingredient and dosages at this point i could change um, the dosage of an herb, I can delete an herb, I can add an herb. It's fully customizable. And whenever you're done, you're going to scroll to the bottom here. You can see your total dosage. You're going to add in your commissions. Let's do about 20% here. You'll receive a check from us at the end of the month. We're going to click bottled because we're going to put it in a bottle. And we're going to put the instructions here. Three scoops twice a day for 10 days. Actually does the math for you down here also, as you can see. There it is, 90 grams is 10 days. 126, one more time. 15 days, about 135 grams. And it says 137 here because it does some rounding. If you want to get it exactly down here, here we go, 134.5. That's exactly 15 days. It does the math for you, excellent. You can put your instructions to go on the label down here. Notes on the patient, notes on the prescription. We're going to go ahead and click review. And there's our formula. You can send it to the patient at this point, and your job is done. They will get an email. They'll get access to our platform. They'll have their own account. They could see their formulas and ingredients. And it's a wonderful thing. It's a very added benefit for them to give to them. And for you as a, uh, as a practitioner, it's a really nice thing to offer to them. Um, also, one other feature we can show today is if you go back here, if you're going to be prescribing this formula a lot and you really like the way it looks, you can just save it under a custom formula. You can name it here. And in the future, when you go to add a formula, you don't have to go through this process again. When you go to add a formula, you just go to your custom formulas or your favorites and it will be in here. All right, that is it today. That is our formula for yin deficiency, uh, I'm sorry, blood deficiency, uh, insomnia, and some modified formula. All right, and now we're gonna talk about herb of the week, Swan Sao Ren. It's one of my favorite herbs, one of the most popular herbs in Chinese medicine, and what an amazing herb it is. Um, it is from the category of calm the spirits. Um, it is neutral, which I really like because it's easy to use in other formulas, so the temperature is neutral. Um, I use this herb frequently in the treatment of not only insomnia, but also anxiety. So Zizifi uh, is a Latin name, 
And the treatment of insomnia is mainly related to the modulation of the 5-HT and GABA synapse pathways. And I believe um, it plays a role also in the sodium channel, um, which also prolongs sleep times. This is significant because 5-HT targets serotonin receptors and GABA is the primary neuroreceptor responsible for providing a calming effect. Research has found that people who experience major depression often also have lower levels of these chemicals. GABA plays a role in regulating the immune system, appetite, and metabolism. This is huge. As always, you guys, all the diseases, patterns, correlating formulas, ingredients, dosages, everything can be found on our site. You can register and start ordering herbs as early as today. Um, if you're a patient and you're suffering from any of the things we discussed today, any of those symptoms, you can book an appointment using this link below. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I hope this information was useful.